Hello, this is Nikki in Niagara coming to you live from Niagara Falls, Canada. And today I am going to show you the contents of Autumn Crafts June subscription box. Uh, it comes in this beautiful bag, which you can use for something. And then when we open it up, we get the box, and we simply open it up. So this, this month's theme was uh, pets, so cats and dogs. I didn't uh, tell her whether I preferred cats or dogs. I have a cat. I don't like dogs, but, uh, so it's not my, I mean, I have a cat, but I'm not like a cat person, so really, it doesn't really bother me either way. This is not going to be my favorite, favorite box here. Fortunately, it's my last one, so, uh, let's see what I think of this stuff. I'm not against having stuff with cats and dogs on it, so we'll take a look. So, open it up, and we have the tissue paper here. Open. Whoops. Am I knocking something over? No. You know what? I'm going to just move the box right out of the way. So, we have the tissue paper with dog's feet on it. And now, we pull it out, and we have everything all bundled together. I absolutely love this. Owls are my absolute favorite, favorite animal. And it is wrapped with doggy ribbon, which is in neon colors and really cute. I think those are dog prints. They might be cat prints. I don't know. I can't tell the difference. I love that. And I love this. I have one very similar very similar to this already, I think. But, yeah, I can't have too many owls. Uh, there we go. The piece of ribbon. It's tied in a bow. I guess I opened it backwards, so we didn't see that. Now here, I'm guessing, is a little card for me. It says, thank you. Oh, I love that. That's so cute. To see? I like cute. And, what does it say? Okay, so the, lady, the owner has a personal message for us about some family issues that are going on, but that she is uh, doing her best to work on these kits. All right, so I'm seeing Kitty. Okay, so we've got we got more plastic wrap on here. With those are definitely dogs on it and that is cool but there's a little pocket in it somehow with a, um, a dashboard for your planner it is of this gorgeous kitty pattern that's on here and on the back is uh, places to visit and their opening times that's that's quite a, a good idea actually Okay, so let's get this open. Now, oh, I see. That is a really nifty way she wrapped that up. Make it have a, a pocket in it. So let's try and get the stuff out. Woohoo! This is good. You know, when I, um, when I canceled this subscription, I was kind of upset because I really like it. So we may see it here again. Okay, first staring us in the face is an absolutely adorable, and this is Japanese, I can just tell because it is so soft. And the Japanese make their plushies just, I don't know what they're made out of, but we don't use it here. So yeah, so this is a pencil case, and well, let's see if there's much room inside, because sometimes, oh yeah, it's got a piece of foam in it, so. So yeah, I mean, it's just, it's just an open pencil case, and you got quite a bit of, quite a bit of space in there. 
and that's adorable. I love that. Even though, as I said at the beginning, I'm not a dog person, I'm not a cat person, but there we go. Oh, oh wow, well, this is nice. So, um, it looks like there's some die cut frames in here along with a charm for your planner. So, let's take a look at the charm first. So that is adorable. I'm not sure what that is. But, I can get that in there. There's a dog. There's a dog paw. A bell. I don't know if you can hear that. And the other one, I don't really know what it is that's on there. That looks like half a bone. That's nice. I like that. Very delicate. And so we got some die cuts. A special gift for you and to the one I love. And then these are die cut frames. There's the outside. Let's get in the frame there. There's the outside one. There's a min mini one here. And then you have the picture. And then this one is the same but square, and it's got a cat and a dog on it. And those are both by the same artist. Those are really cute. I like those. Okay, now. <laughs> this is adorable. <laughs> okay, so, like, I like cute. So I'm not going to complain about it being a dog, because that's just adorable. That is a ruler. Uh, and it is in, in, it is in centimeters. That's because, um, oh, this is uh, Japanese as well. Fuleja. I've got to open this to see what it's like. Oh, it's a nice, it's a nice ruler. Okay, first of all, you get the backing paper, which can be used in your planner or crafts. And then this is quite, uh, that's quite a nice a ruler. It's a nice sharp edge on it there too. Well, not sharp, but you know, for tearing. Yeah, I really like that. That's adorable. Okay, then we got a couple of sheets of stickers. These are all kitty stickers and they're Japanese and I just absolutely adore them. And we got two more sheets. And these are both kitties. And they're all three are different. All three of them are different. So that's cool. I can't wait to like look at this, but I'm saving it for the last. Oh, oh wait, I'm missing stuff. Okay, so here we have some washi tape. And this is adorable. It's all dog themed except for the last one, which is uh which is cat. But there's a, uh, I'm recording. There's a lot of washi here. Um, usually you get a small card like this wrapped around with it. This is like twice as much as you would normally get. And these, these are nice. I really like them. Try and give you a, try and give you a show. There's the doggies. And there's the kitties. Very nice. Okay, now this is the same pattern that we've had twice before on our card. And what was, well, there was something else that had that pattern on it. Was it our dashboard? I don't know. Can't remember. So, anyways, this says lovely little sticky notes. Oh, that's adorable. So we got a little to-do list here with a kitty on it. And then we got some a, a sticky note here with a wiener dog and uh, four flags, which don't have anything to do with animals. They just match the colors. Those are really pretty. I love those. Really nice. And these are by 180 sticky notes in three sizes by Rachel Ellen. And she's from the UK. Okay, now this was out of my way so I wasn't quite seeing this. Here we have a present thank you, a present for you in a adorable bag that you just can't rip when you're opening this because it's so pretty. Look at that. 
Hey, oops, there you go. Isn't that cute? Okay, so we've got two pens. Oh, no. Okay, so we've got a pen and we've got Side after I've I've pushed it open, but it does. oh oh no, pff, it's not a pen. It's a mechanical pencil. That's what I thought it was at first. So that's got a little uh, doggy. Is it gonna go into focus for us? Focus. I guess not. Uh, so anyways, that's a little dog with pink spots. That's cute. And this is a Fio. And it's a 0.7, so that's a, a fine nib, but a decent size. And then the other one is just a regular pencil that we sharpen. And it's got uh, dogs, silhouettes of dogs all over it. Okay, now the last thing is this big notebook. I mean, look at this thing. This is like... Um, what size would you call that? 9 by 12? 13? Does it say on the back? Um, I'm looking. That's by Wilco. And it doesn't say. So, guarding brilliant ideas. Oh, wow. Look at that. And look how big the lines are on it, too. Alright, so every page is the same. I mean, this is just... I love notebooks. I love this. This is really nice. This is the type of thing that, um, you know, if you're in school, you could definitely use this for your classes. But it's just great for taking notes and writing in. Wow, I really like that. So, let's go over what we got. We got the huge notebook. We got the adorable... There, I'm going to zoom out a little bit so we can get everything in. Whoops, wrong way. Okay, so we got the adorable pencil case. I'm not going to show the papers. Okay, yeah, here we are. This is the dashboard. Uh, we have a little thank you note. We have, in the same pattern, we have our sticky notes. We have three sheets of cat stickers. We have some washi tape, generous portions there. This adorable wiener dog array, uh, ruler. And two pencils, a normal one and a mechanical one. And um, I must have told her somewhere along the way I liked owls because she... I caught this clip. Uh, then we have the two um, die cut frames, two words, the charm, and last but not least is the bow that it was all wrapped up in. Some ribbon. Very nice. I'll be sad. I'm sad to see that one go. So this was June. So I hope you enjoyed that. If uh, you want to see how what I think of products after I've used them, then please visit my blog called Outside the Living Outside the Subscription Box, and I'll leave a link to that down below. And uh, I will see you next time. And I'll leave a link to Autumn Crafts as well. It's wonderful. The really good thing about it is, is that it's from the UK, so you get British stuff, and obviously you can see there's Japanese stuff in here too. So, uh, talk to you later. Have a wonderful day. Bye.